Hello, Susan Heller with Remax Action here in sunny Southwest Florida. Thank you so much for visiting our video blog. Topic of the day is a strategy. What is a strategy for creating multiple offers and a bidding war to get the seller's top dollar? Stay tuned. So sellers are asking, what is the top dollar I can get from my property? How do we do that? What are you doing in this market to create bidding wars and multiple offers and actually sell over asking price in many cases? And there is a strategy. When we meet and we prepare a market evaluation, we're looking at this data a little differently today than we have in the past. And having an appraisal background certainly has helped me evaluate and determine the best price for my clients and even appeal appraisals in the past. In this market, there are very few appraisals needed because we have so many cash buyers. And what we're looking at rather than the closed sales are the pending sales. What price caused the property to get the activity necessary to generate an acceptable offer? We also look very closely at active listings. What does a buyer have to pay to purchase a similar home in today's market? So in looking at this data, we determine a fair price to go on the market and we will likely price it over the most recent comps and somewhere in the range between the pending and the active so we can generate enough activity to get a lot of buyers in the door, a lot of other agents wanting to show it, as many eyes as possible. Quite often we will do this and property on the market immediately. We order photography, professional photography, virtual tour, video. We want to make sure that we introduce it to the market and that all of the virtual buyers are able to see everything the property has to offer. We go live on the MLS typically on a Wednesday and we will have showings both live and virtual, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, culminating in the finale. The grand finale is the open house on Sunday. And quite often there will be multiple agents and buyers in the home. They are looking at the property, they are looking at the amount of activity the property is generating, and they are making offers. In the MLS, we list highest and best offer by Monday at noon. And by Monday at noon, it is quite common that we will have four, five, six, seven, eight offers on our listings, many selling well above the asking price. And at that point, this is how we generate the highest and best offer by allowing the market to see the property, by getting ample opportunity for the buyers and the agents to make an offer. We don't want to sell the property in the first day. That tells me that you may have left money on the table. By giving it four days, we can draw out all of the interest in the market. Everyone that's been looking and waiting for a home like yours to come on the market has an opportunity to see it and to bid on it. That is fair to the buyers, to the agents, and most importantly, to the sellers to get the highest and best price. Always call Susan, 239-248-8000. Again, 239-248-8000 and make it a great day.